First, I want to say howdy, partners, to all of our dealers and to DAC International, who's our international distributor. I'm Tom Harper, Director of Marketing for Avidine. As you know, we've introduced a full line of panel-mounted plug-and-play avionics uh, that I'm sure a lot of you guys are anticipating and wanting to uh, start installing. I'm proud to say the, uh, as we've chiseled away at the certifications on these products, we've completed uh, TSO and ETSO on our audio panel, the AMX240. It's a full-featured audio panel. It lists for $23.95. We also have TSO and ETSO on our AXP340 mode S transponder. This transponder meets the mandate for ADS-B out. So we're moving through that. It's a plug and play for some legacy transponders you see here. Of course, the IFD 540 and 440 FMS systems were uh, in the throes of uh, validation, getting that ready for red labels so that we can submit it to the FAA. And we uh, hope to be shipping that by the end of Q2. It's a great product. It's a uh, hybrid touch, geofill, plug and play for some legacy G530, 430. So there's a lot of opportunities out there for you guys uh, with these products. I'm sure you're looking forward to them as much as we are. Easy to say, it'll be the best panel-mounted GPS out there once it hits the market. So we are working on some uh, free play simulation products that uh, will help our customers with training, et cetera, and product familiarization, including an iPad app and a PC-based sim. Uh, those should be done prior to certification, so you should see those in early Q2. We also have uh, pilots gu draft pilots guides and install manuals available on the dealer site. So if you want to start previewing those and, and showing your, pointing your customers at the pilot's guides, that, uh, they'll be uh, excited for that. We have certified our DFC-90 since uh, last we spoke here on the 182 with the, S with the Aspen EFD-1000 Pro, as well as the Cirrus and a wide range of Bonanza uh, aircraft, uh, bringing straight and level and envelope protection to a much wider range of aircraft and we're going to continue to chisel away on that certification list. And finally, we, uh, I hope to announce that we were certified for uh, our R9-3, which is uh, for our Integra Release 9 system. It's at the FAA, and I would say it's imminent for certification. And uh, Release 9-3, of course, adds synthetic vision, our three display configuration, and uh, onboard weather radar. So that's going to help us with some OEM opportunities and certainly we have a lot of customers out there that are interested in the synthetic vision. We'll be continuing to pursue other opportunities with R9 once we get through the 540. That certainly is our priority at this point, you can rest assured. We are in booth 1117, come visit us. And again, uh, welcome to AEA and come by and see us, we'd love to have you as our partners, thanks. Aero TV's coverage of the 57th Annual AEA International Convention and Trade Show, live from Nashville, Tennessee, is brought to you in part by the following sponsors. Today's pilots must have power for electronic flight bags, tablets, iPads, and communication devices. The TA-102 Dual USB Charging Port delivers more power with less hassles. Available from your local avionics dealer. Small, light, and ADS-B compatible. The Sandia Aerospace STX-165 Mode AC Transponder provides an uncommon value for today's aircraft. Check it out now at www.sandia.aero. Over the past two decades, no resource has compiled as much expert valued information about the sport plane world than the Sport Plane Resource Guide. Over 1,500 pages, hundreds of aircraft, dozens of how-tos and directories. All this and more will be coming to the sport aviation world soon with the new all-electronic and updatable Sport Plane Resource Guide for your iPad, iPhone, Kindle, tablet, PC, or other electronic devices. Get your order in now www.sportplane.com